What constitutes a commercially reasonable sale of personal property? Hi, I'm Deanne Cole, and I'm an attorney with Bakke Norman. Once a lender eventually repossesses collateral after default, the law requires that the eventual sale of that collateral be done in a commercially reasonable manner. So, what does that mean? The primary focus of the commercial reasonableness of a given sale is not the proceeds from the eventual sale, but rather the procedures employed for that sale. If the secured creditor makes certain that conditions of the sale in terms of the aggregate effect of the manner, method, time, place, and terms employed conform to commercially accepted standards, the creditor should be shielded from any liability. Wisconsin authorizes the disposition of collateral in either public or private proceedings so long as a standard of commercial reasonableness is followed. Wisconsin courts have held that the secured party must choose between a public or private sale depending on which is more co commercially reasonable. In sum, there's no clear-cut answer as to what is commercially reasonable. Therefore, it would be wise to review each sale on a case-by-case -case basis or discuss any potential sale with your attorney.